going to be spooky tea viral fall filter from tiktok Ooh. oh that's so pretty <laughs> that they couldn't do it Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new and a good morning and happy October 1st. It is the first day of October and we have quite a bit to do today. Today we have a couple of errands to run. I have some appointments to go to. We are going to drop my sister and her friend off at work around 2-ish and then my mom and I are going across town to go to Hobby Lobby to get stuff for her business and then we're gonna go to my eye appointment and then after that we're gonna go to the place where I get my glasses made. I probably have not ran around like this in months and as of right now it is 10 30 and it is october 1st so to celebrate october 1st i am wearing the bone to be spooky tee so if you guys would like to grab one you guys can click the link down below to visit my etsy shop for rarity.me it is time for me to go eat some breakfast start this phone transfer to the computer and then continue the morning agenda So I just did my socials. So for socials today, it is the sneak peek of the launch. By the time this vlog comes out, this should already be launched. But it is the beautiful, as always, sweatshirt. And I just absolutely am obsessed with the design. So pretty much it's on a white sweatshirt with a ghost that says beautiful, as always, a little bit of some positivity. And I also included a cute little flat lay. And if you guys did not watch the fall launch behind the scenes vlog, the pumpkins are from Walmart and the leaves are from the Dollar Tree and I did a DIY backdrop which a reel should be coming out for that soon but I also posted some stories so happy October 1st and then the new reel I decided to test out the viral fall filter from TikTok on my workspace and I must say it's actually kind of insane especially right here it changed the color of my mats and my pencil holders and then the new post that I did and I did a thing that says time to go through what's still available from the fall launch so far so I've launched a total of five out of 13 or 14 designs that I plan on launching for the fall season and then this is the bone to be spooky tea we are sold out in larges sweatshirt we are sold out in for the sweater weather the large and 2xl and then the tote bags are sold out hats are sold out and the lawn sleeve shirt that just came out this week is sold out in a large so there are still four left for sales Yes, and then it just Look stays. At that. And then when you turn it off, here, this one is. It just stays floating. Look at this. That's so pretty. And it catches the light. 
That's so pretty. It's like a Christmas disco ball light thing. Ooh. Oh, that's so pretty. <laughs> an update so I went and got my eye exam which went really well you know it was quite the struggle to um, do that test it was so weird because I went in there expecting like someone else like a physical human being to be doing the test and it wasn't like I sat in a chair and boop on the screen in front of me where there's a little webcam someone else you know popped up on the screen and she like a robot controlled everything in the room it was kind of crazy cool kind of creepy but we opted not to do frames at the place where i do my exam because i've been going to imart express for the entirety that i lived in texas and apparently because of my prescription one of my eyes their cylinder was i think over negative seven or whatever the lady said to try walmart because walmart should take anything that has to do with vsp we get to walmart we, we were literally all the way across town and then we drove to the other end of town we get to walmart in the vision center and as soon as she heard the insurance she said that they couldn't do it so my mom and i decided to go to aldi's get snacks and dinner and now we're home speaking of snacks let's do a quick little snack haul so of course we have to do salt and vinegar chips these are the kettle chips by the brand clancy's i also started snacking on these they are cashews dill pickled flavor they actually taste really good which i'm shocked about bada beam bada booms i love these things so much and then lastly i have this non-gmo dark chocolate and sea salt gluten-free oats i eat these like they're granola and sometimes with cereal but most likely i will put them in a baggie and take them with me to go for a snack but now your girl is just really really hungry so i'm going to go finish dinner I'm starving. And this is where the vlog ends. So if you've made it this far, thank you so much for watching this entire video. I appreciate you so much. And if you're not a lovely subscriber yet, you definitely should be. There's a lot more content on the way.